Hey guys, this is Today I Grew Up doing another video review. I'm really excited today because we have Jurassic World toys. And these are the ones I got from Jurassic World so far. So we have kind of the storyboard kind of characters. And then we have in the back the Gyrosphere RC, which I'm really stoked about. So let's just get into these toys one by one. And I'll tell you guys what I think of them. So the first toy that I got here from Jurassic World uh, was the Velociraptor Blue and Owen. I think it's a really cool set. I wanted a blue figure and I wanted another Owen action figure and I'll tell you guys that why after this. But let's uh, look at the packaging, the volcano's exploding behind them. It says here that blue has a springing action. He has some kind of uh, action mode so he can like spring forward. And then on the back, uh, here we have close up of them. So we're gonna open it and uh, take a closer look at it. I think they did really good. Uh, I mean, it could have looked more like Chris Pratt, in my opinion. They probably could have done a better job, but from far away, I think they did. I mean, it does look like him. Uh, I recognize oh, him as Owen. So it's cool. It has an arm guard here. It's his trainer, so you could train Blue to bite um, on command. He has the same. I think all these figures like move the same. There's nothing special about them besides the fact that they look like the characters but i really think it's cool i think they did a, a really good job on the owen figure i think blue is awesome uh it's cool that the mouth moves all the way open like this you can see they did a good job with the mouth and close it as well and then it's cool because the head could turn and go up and down as well and move side to side and then his arms move as well and then I like the detailing on his claws here on his feet he does have a little scan code feature for your smartphone if you're into that and then his tail has a crease there but it's just kind of like a flexible material which is nice and then this part's a harder plastic so it's just his tail I think is a little more flexible and then he has a springing action which I'll show you right now Good job on Blue. It's awesome. Blue, you have to have him sit down, then you let go. Well, that worked really well. So you sit him down like this, and then you gotta quickly let go. That's awesome. Totally works. So that was Owen and Blue. Let's move on to the next Jurassic World toy. And Claire, the ball that spins and moves. And in the back, it just kind of shows how to put the figures in there so the packaging is cool it's nothing it, to me it's nothing too special it's pretty standard so I think they did a really good job with Claire here on the face sculpt I really like the articulation of the head it moves pretty nice you can do some up and down poses to the side it's nice that her hair is kind of pulled back so it looks more in the she's like in the work environment and which is interesting is her her jacket's actually flexible here you can open it up. I don't know why you'd want to do that, um, but it's cool that, I mean, it just makes them look probably more realistic that the coat can move slightly. She's got some very stylish boots on. Even has the treads on the bottom, which I'm impressed with. So the detail was really spot on with just the wrinkles or the lines and stuff like that. So the shiny belt buckle looks like a gold one. She poses and moves her arms just like the other figures but uh yeah they did a good job on this i really like this claire figure so this is cool um this thing is very uh it doesn't it doesn't feel cheap it feels really heavy duty there's a heavy weight on the bottom of it so it's gonna keep it spinning i mean if you wanted to you can it'll it'll spin pretty well it's nice that it has the seats it even looks like it has the foot grips on the bottom like a real like the real one would have it's kind of insane and then this is really cool so it has a, a glass kind of like a broken glass feature like the dinosaur was trying to break through effect so that's really cool so here they are i put um claire and owen together in there as you can see it rotates and they stay in place so now i'm going to put this on to cover them I haven't, done, I haven't done this yet so yeah so there was a lock feature there that you saw you just slid it to lock it 
So now they're locked in place. And this is what they look like inside. It's a really cool effect, I think, with the, the glass especially. Broken glass effect is really cool. So if the, as they move, you see that. That kind of rotating like that, which is awesome. <laughs> they go backwards. So there's a size comparison of the, the Chomp and T Extreme Chomp and T Rex in blue, and the Gyrosphere with that comes with Claire. So we are going to open up the RC Gyrosphere and compare it with this one right here. So here's the Gyrosphere RC, which is really cool. It's got a remote control, it fits two figures. I really like the artwork. I think it's kind of excessive though. I feel like the box is way too big for this. Um, it's, I think it's weird. This is another RC vehicle you can get, but I just wanted this one. And this one, this one comes with an Owen figure already, but I heard that it wasn't a good quality one, so that's why I got another one. But yeah, it's pretty cool. If we compare sizes from the one that came with Claire Gyrosphere to this this RC remote one, um, you can see that it's a lot better because it, it the details are there. You have a Jurassic World logo in the back, like the ride would have, and it just has a nicer paint job. This is just a dark color; it's not as accurate. Um, so this is definitely the one to have for the movie accuracy one because the seats look cool too. Um, I really like that. So the figure that came with this was this Owen. Um, the sad part about this Owen is that it's not a real figure. I kind of lied to you guys. Look at this. There's no back to him. So it's like it's not like a real toy. And his arms don't, don't move. Nothing moves. He's just like stuck in this seated position. So it's a really cheap thing that they did. I so if you look at the, the one that came with blue ra uh, Voss Raptor and then you look at the one that came with the Gyrosphere, they don't look anything alike if you take a close look at these two figures here. They don't look anything alike. Um, this one's definitely not as good. I think this one's a lot better. It looks more like Chris Pratt. And, so I'm going to put these, I'm going to put the real, the better looking Owen and Claire inside the awesome Gyrosphere RC. So yeah, I recommend, it has some peg holes down here. This does take four um, double A batteries, so you need to put that, and then the remote control takes, um, two triple A batteries, so make sure you don't have it. So we're gonna put this back on, you just kind of slip it in there, nothing complicated about this at all, it's pretty straightforward. You just gotta, this part's a little tricky, you gotta line it up perfectly so that it lines up and locks into place. Um, there we go, we have it locked into place now. If you press down on the remote, what happens is it spins in a circle. So this is really handy if you want to change directions, because um, if you press up, it drives forward. Oh, well, I had to catch that. So wherever you're at, you can kind of tap on it to twist it or hold it down and it spins. So that's, down arrow is really useful. And then obviously if you press up, it'll come to you. It'll drive forward. So I'm going to slowly take it over to the other side of the table and bring it back without dropping it off this table. So I got it over there. Now I'm going to turn it back around and let it come. Yeah, so that's cool. Um, this definitely works really well and uh, it's way better than the gyrosphere that Claire came with. It's really fun and uh, goes pretty fast too. Um, it's super cool. So I recommend the RC, it's not that expensive. I think it's like 30 bucks or something. You can actually get it on Amazon. I've seen it at Target and Walmart. If you want to compare it to the T-Rex, there we have the T-Rex. Chomping, extreme chomping T-Rex here. Very cool. I think he's uh, really into scale with the gyrosphere. And then we also have blue here. So you can see the size comparison, I think. They nailed it with um, just making it feel like you have the movie in your hands. If you're if you're a kid, you're just gonna have so much fun with this. But if you're a collector, it's it's really cool display piece as well. Um, so it's pretty awesome. It's pretty cool, guys. So I definitely recommend this toy. 
if you're a collector or you just want to play and have fun, yeah, you'll have hours of fun with it. All right, so this has been my video review on the Gyrosphere RC toy. If you like what you see, please like and subscribe. Um, I have a lot of uh, fun videos coming for you guys in this next week. So please like and subscribe and share with your friends. And I'll see you guys on the next toy review.